Have you had the McRib? No. Have you had the McRib? No. Do you want to get the McRib? Sounds good to me. All right. Let's get ready to rumble! Is it the Yeah, can I get two McRibs? Two McRibs? Yeah, can I get two McRibs? What else for you? Uh, can I get those as combos? Um, What's your drink? Dr. Pepper. Uh, Dr. Pepper with one and water with the other. What else for you? That'll be it. 1588, please pour Alright, thank you. The combo for a McRib is $7.49. Is it really worth that much? <laughs> it's a once a year thing. Which I don't know how long McRib season lasts. How long is it? I don't either. I think it's about up. Let's, I want to say it ends. I'm going to look it up. That's what I'm going to do. I have to get my wallet out of my pocket. <laughs> yeah, I, as soon as I get in the car, dude, I take out my wallet. Normally, if I know I'm going somewhere, I'll take it out if I know I'm going to eat somewhere. But I, I haven't been since the new year started. So I just, that was, that was an insane price. Like, think of the crystals we got, man, for yeah. like $5. Well, it said it returned on December 2nd. Which, I mean, it's kind of an old flame. Everybody's kind of tried it by now. We're kind of late on the try. And you would think we would have. I mean, I know my dad loves the McRib. It just reminds me of what you have in high school. The, uh, the, the the little boneless yeah they call it ribs rib patty. boneless ribs or something oh and I feel like that's the exact vibe that I'm gonna get from it maybe an enhanced version but the same concept um, it comes with onions and pickles on it I know that there's a thing called the McRib locator <laughs> uh, it's not that good I, it can't be that good anything from McDonald's can't be that good that where you have to locate it from a store like, the nugs man I mean yeah the nugs nuggets are that but good. the the outcry if they got rid of nuggets would be it's their thing, dude. That's It's the yeah. McNugget. Well, okay, so we got the McRib combo. So we got the fries, drink, and the McRib. But the big, like, go-to piece of the meal is the McRib. And we want to eat it as hot as possible to give it every fighting chance. Because both of us have not had one. Um, oh. But we definitely want to give it a shot. Fries? Yeah, just hold on. Yeah, they put the fries on top. Oh, nice, nice. So. I haven't ate fast food all year so far. So I'm about to eat something fast food and I know it's gonna like spiral out of control and I'm gonna want more the McRib baby it's heavier than I thought it was gonna be it does have some girth to it, some weight this is what everybody's going on about huh better not be a mess dude uh it's definitely a mess <laughs> you guys can't see the down inside of it but uh yeah here let me let me see if I can get this yeah, that's how the box comes. Oh my god. I don't know how I'm gonna eat. Oh. Let me so, get the napkins out first. So you've got onions and pickles and just the McRib patty. Yeah, I appreciate that. Because it's about to get messy. Now from what I've been told, they don't make the McRib as meaty or not as meaty, but as saucy as they used to. Well I'm surprised, because I mean it's that's as saucy as I feel like you can get without it being just soup. Oh my gosh. All right, you ready? Yeah, we're going for it. Tastes just like that meat at school. <laughs> it does. The bun's better. Uh-huh. The bun's really good. It's got like a, I don't know what you call that bun. Hmm. It's so messy. You know when you get the item and you're like, man, I really feel unhealthy for eating this. This is that item. Yeah. I mean, it's obviously fake meat. Oh, yeah. I don't know what it is, but... It's not bad. The pickles and the onion go with it really well. I mean, but like... I haven't even gotten any pickles. Or on... I got some onion, but I didn't get any pickles. Well, I had a pickle that fell off. I think I had like three pickles total. I mean, it's just like a sloppy mess, but. I just don't know about it. I mean, it's not something that I would rant and rave about. I mean, the onions and pickles are fresh. Yeah. But you're right. I mean, it ain't nothing special. Well, would you get this over a quarter pounder or a Big Mac? or nuggets or like anything from McDonald's you normally get? No. Can't say I would I'll, either. I don't miss it. I mean, I can see getting it like when it comes around once a year, you know, like, oh, let's get the McRib. Yeah. But it's, I can definitely tell it shouldn't be a permanent menu item. Yeah. I don't know why it's during the, the winter though. 
Why wouldn't it be during the summer? When barbecue's like yeah. popular? I don't know. Or maybe they change it yearly. Maybe it's not always the same. But, yeah, I'm not sure what kind of bun that is. I don't either. It's like, I don't know, it has some it's weird... A sub it's bun. It's not sesame seeds. But... I've got pickle in it and you need that one. Yeah. You know, honestly though, the, fr the flavor profile is good. But like I said, it's not something I would go to to get. But at least we can both say we've actually had one. Honestly, finally. the bread is the star of this sandwich. Yeah, the bread is really good. I like. I mean, it's got like a. I don't know what's on top of it. Of the top of the bun. Yeah. But it's just like a sub bun. But like, like I'm comparing it to like a a bun from like Subway or something. Yeah. I would rather have this bun than really like Subway bun. Huh. As far as bun goes. I mean, well, it's like soft Well, do you get yours bread. toasted from Subway? Yeah. So, yeah, I do too. And then it's like biting into a brick <laughs> if they leave it in the toaster for like oh, two seconds yeah. longer than it's supposed to be. It's burnt. A lot of people are like, oh, it's the worst thing that they could come out with. They're awful. Don't get them. Mm -hmm. But if you actually try one, I mean, they're not bad. If you keep an open mind, I mean, like, as soon as I open the box, it looks like a mess. And it's definitely not one of those items you can just eat driving down the road. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Unless you want to walk into work with a bunch of sauce on you. Yeah. I would save it for later kind of situation. But overall, I mean, my only fast food meal of this year so far, I'm kind of sad that it, this is the item we went to first. <laughs> but uh, there'll be more. So, like, I have something to look forward to, I guess. Yeah. Um, all right. On a scale of 1 to 10, what are you going to rate it? What are we it? rating it? What's a 10? Best barbecue? No. I like guess they're like... <laughs> Just on the McDonald's menu. Okay. Three, two, one. Four. Six. I was going to do a six. Really? I think it's better than like the filet of fish I'm not big on. And like there's some other items on the menu. But like it's no Big Mac or Nuggets or. Yeah. I, I mean, know. it's like a low six, okay? Like almost <laughs> a five, but. I, I rated it even below the filet of fish. I mean, oh, the really? filet of fish, I like fish. It's crispy and oh man. It, it's a classic. It's a classic. I personally have never had the filet of fish but the smell alone <laughs> gets me like, nah, I don't think I want to try that. You gotta love the filet of fish commercial, man. I do like the commercial. They did good there. <laughs> they don't have no like McRib commercial like that, do they? I don't think so. The month's gone. They just have the one that's like, the McRib is back. Oh yeah. Yeah. And that's it. That's all they need. The sauce was good. I mean, we didn't talk about the sauce at all, but the barbecue sauce was all right. Well, Mine's gone. Yours is gone. So they don't last long at all, at least between us. <laughs> and then the fries, man. I don't know what we were waiting on for so long because these fries don't really taste fresh either. So I can't see the McRib. That McRib. They must have had like a new cook in the back. It's like, hasn't made them yet. And we just come at the wrong time. I think that's gonna do it for us. If you have any suggestions as far as uh, video ideas go, we'd love to hear it. If you have any other items on a restaurant that you guys would like to see us try, we would love to try them. I mean, it's a pretty simple idea, but I mean, we have never had the McRib, so there's yeah. probably several things out there that one of us haven't had. Yeah, if so. there's like an exclusive item, you know, kind of like the McRib that only comes around every so often. Yeah, I think the nacho fries at Taco Bell just came back too, so if you hadn't oh, had yeah. those, they're, they're pretty good. I've, I've tried them a couple times. I didn't like them when I tried them, but things like that, so uh, just let us know in the comments. Uh, if yep. you like the video, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah, see y'all next time.